In this how-to video, I'm going to show how to make changes to the FTP directory browsing in IIS Manager on a Windows 2008 R2 server. First thing we need to do is open up IIS Manager. From here, we can double-click on the name of our server and then double-click on FTP browsing. By default, we're going to look at the browsing in MS-DOS. We can change that here to Unix. The look is slightly different, but everything else is basically the same. We can also display information in the listing, such as virtual directories. Virtual directories are not necessarily physical directories in an FTP site. They could be in another physical location, but they're linked to the same FTP site. So we can show that, that if a virtual directory exists, we can show that linkage there. Uh, we can also show the available bytes that uh, are there in case you want to upload or download a lot of files. That way you can see what's available left on that folder for uploading. And the last option is we can allow four digit years so you can see that spelled out. It makes it a little bit easier to understand the, uh, the file date that was created. When done, we can go ahead and hit apply.